How's it going, dude? It's Michael here, and welcome back to Bully Scholarship Edition, and we need to get to class now because it's geography. So yeah, last episode we defeated the jocks, we, we gained the trust of the nerds, and why is he after me and not the, those other kids who are committing truancy, or do they have different class schedules? Who knows, but I'm going to class, whether he likes it or not. But geography class number four. Good news, class. Today we will be looking at some exciting new maps. Can yes! I love maps. Oh, we're looking at Africa. Chad. That's right. Nope. No, I'm sorry. That Egypt. Is incorrect. That's right there. I don't want to say that. Ethiopia. That's right there. And Chad is the camel. By Jove, you've done it, Hopkins! What a Giga Chad move to name your country Chad. Hey there. Greetings, friend. What's going on? My mom calls me Prince Algy. She says I'm really special. Like, like a prince, you know? I agree with her. There's this girl, you see? And I want to put some chocolates in her locker. Will you do it? No, what? How about instead of chocolates? I put you in a locker. In the locker instead. I'll let you out tomorrow. Critical hit. Why do you always have to hit me? What? Is that a banana or a corner of the cop? That's a banana. No. Algie's running away from a girl. Ha <laughs> Throw marbles at him, he's gonna trip and fall, and I'm gonna be in math learning about Why stuff. Why you may never use what's taught in my class? That doesn't give you the right to play hooky. Shut up, Patrick. I'm doing spins in here. What is the fastest? Aeroplane. Which is the lowest? 0.2. How many? Pay attention. Wrong. That's... Sure. No! I want another cool math shirt! What did I do to deserve a dunce cap? Alright, where should we go first? There's a mission over here, let's see what it is. Ow! Why am I? I'm going into a mission. Ch called cheating time. Mr. Galloway, should you really be doing that? Oh, Jimmy. No, I suppose not, but life is unfair! You promised Ms. Phillips. Oh, God. What kind of world do we live in where I get punished for a minor indiscretion and Patrick gets away with taking bribes from his pupils? He does? Yes. He sells advanced copies of tests to the sons of his rich friends and nobody says a word. Wait, what rich friends? Well, Darby Harrington for one. I can't believe he's selling tests. What if I got evidence of him doing this? <laughs> then I'd never need to drink again. All right, let me see what I can do. Okay, let's wear a wire and get evidence, climb onto the auto body shop rooftop. Okay, Hazmat Man is going to be secret agent Hazmat Man. <laughs> Scared the hell out of everyone. Just dropping out of the roof like that. Oh, just that girl came in swinging. Sir, of course, I trust you have my this is for failing me in math. He looks like Alchi. <laughs> We're gonna do a jump over the little kids. Oh, <laughs> I just broke them up. They don't love each other anymore. Morality is the most important lesson we can teach the youth. Is that so? Then you might want to look at these. What's this? It's that fat evil hypocrite selling test answers to rich kids. Fire them. What? You took pictures? And to think I trusted you, hat trick. You're fired. Who's gonna be in charge of my math classes now? What's this mission? I'm curious. Marking a mark. <laughs> <laughs> that is funny, Jimmy. No, it's not. Jimmy, it's really funny. Chill out, man. Jimmy, I need to talk to you about something. Not now, Pete. I'm basking in adulation. I mean, running the school fairly. Dude, so fairly. No, Jimmy, please. Pete, enough. Yeah, shut up, Pete. The court must know they're king. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, Jimmy? 
Forget the school. The whole town should know about you. You're like the mayor. You should leave your mark on City Hall. Yeah, <laughs> dude. Take a dump on the doorstep. <laughs> no, you homunculus. Not a dump. It's something much more elegant. Paint a warning. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll show everyone who's boss. That's right, Jimmy. All right, you girls wait here. This is gonna be something they'll never forget. Wait, Jimmy, don't forget about Gary. Wait, wait for me. I don't like this. I think Gary's working with them to get rid of me. Why does everyone hate my hazmat helmet? It is the coolest thing ever. They won't know it's me, Jimmy, because it's hazmat, man. All right, we gotta go take a picture from the ground. Okay, let's return to the dorm. Why was there so many prefects there? Where are they all going? Are they going on strike? <laughs> I did it! That's great. Listen, we've got a problem. I'm the king, Petey, the king! Whatever, you're a king with a load of problems. I've only been gone a couple hours, what could have happened? All kinds of things. You remember that promise you made about restoring law and order and improving the school? Let's just say it ain't exactly coming true. Well, if anyone wants a fight, I'm right here. I think Gary must be behind it, but trust me, everyone wants a fight. Listen, I gotta go. I'll talk to you later. Oh, man. I lost respect from the jocks, the greasers, the preppies. Oh, God, the nerds. Hopefully that 25 is just algae. But I did gain 25 respect from the townies. <laughs> For spray painting there. I'm spray painting their town hall. So I have 25 o over the board. Still have 100% in the bullies though. I want to do I want to see the homeless man one last time. I suppose you want to train again? Yes. Good to see you have Show me how to kill a man. There's a special way to grab someone's head and punch it. I'm just kicking him while he's down. Bam. <laughs> Take this. What the hell? <laughs> no sweat. I better go make sure he's okay. It's just a beam of light. Alright, let's head back to the dorm. It's bedtime. I don't understand why hey you, you wear that on your head. That shirt looks How's awful. it going? It's a math shirt. It's a math shirt. Everyone just has high taste. No, because everyone's being mean to Hazmat Man. <laughs> Telling him his shirt's ugly and his Hazmat mask is ugly and Algie now. Maybe he'll he'll still be my friend. Algie. Hey there. Lose your head. I hate you. Your mom. Ooh, I'm so angry. All right. Let's head. What class is it going to be today? I'm wearing school-approved uniforms. Trust me. I approve them myself. Me. You're such a loser. Look at you. Don't hurt. Why is everyone so mean to me? What did I do to them? Be nice, get through classes, get through the school year, but no. Goddamn, Gary had to go t behind my back and tell him I hate everyone's mom. And their moms. And their moms. This is a disgrace! It's appalling! I don't want plays or a pet rat! This is your fault, Jimmy! Huh? What? No, it isn't. What are you guys talking about? Uh, the library uh, is full uh, of rats! Uh, and I got my pre-pre-pre-med test next week, amigo! Uh, you're such a lame old! Uh, Some king you turned out to be! Oh, how I long for the old days! Sure, we were laughed at and mercilessly bullied by everyone, but at least you could study without fear of rodents coming near us! Uh, 
yourself again, Algie? Ew. No, oh, I swear. Algie. I spilled soda on myself. Soda. Oh. Right. What a bunch of sissies. Well, I'm not afraid of a few rats. Jeez, pathetic. Hazmat man's prepared for rats. What do you think the hazmat mask is for? Here, let's see if what a firecracker does. Another good deed done. No, don't judge me on my hat. Do you want me to put the rats back in the library? The gym is burning. God damn it, am I gonna play firefighter? By the stairs next to the locker room, but don't think I've forgiven you, Hopkins. It wasn't me. It looked like you were about to give a speech there though, so I regret nothing. That's that's the guy. I always knew I could do it. Yeah, and I did do it, and I'm proud. Oh, where the hell did that guy come from? Jesus fuck, he scared me! Oh! Finding Johnny Vincent. Where did Johnny Vincent go? It's not my fault. Someone said they saw a couple of asylum orderlies driving up to his house. But you know how people love to talk. Johnny wasn't crazy. Asylum orderlies? He was a real leader. Not like you, Jimmy. Look, I'll get your boy back, alright? See you later, freaks. I already know my way to the asylum. Get out of here, or I'm calling the cops. Motherfucker. I came to visit my grandma. She's here. Why can't I visit her? It's visitation hours. It's fucking three o'clock in the afternoon. Alright, hazmat man is gonna become orderly man. So much stuff. Can't please tell me it keeps on the hat. God damn it. Come on, Johnny, you could help. I'm gonna go to bed tonight, all I'm gonna hear is that siren. Thanks for getting me out, Jimmy. How'd you get in there to begin with? Some of the local kids said they'd gotten together with Lola. I went a little crazy. I can believe that. Yeah, anyway, so I gotta find Lola, see if it's true or not. See ya. All right, Johnny, have fun. Johnny is a good guy. Jimmy Hopkins He's a little delivers. overprotective. What are you looking at? Nothing. Well, it looks like you're looking at me, scumbag. Like I said, I can't see nothing. anything in this oh, hazmat on, suit. Sorry. You. My name's Jimmy. Zoe. I was at Bullworth once. I got kicked out. Why? Let's just say Mr. Burton is a dirty creep. Seriously? I would love to teach that guy a lesson. He bullies everyone. You know, he goes jogging every day and regularly uses the porta potties in the park. Yuck. Yeah. So if we could catch him in one on top of a hill, then Mr. Burton could have a really interesting time in it. Yeah, but they're all chained together. We'll need to get some bolt cutters. Go get some from the Spaz Industries building and meet me at the park. Make sure no one sees you. I don't know where I'm going. Where am I going? I didn't beat up that poor defenseless kid. I swear. It wasn't me. It was Mr. Burton. Mr. Policeman, there's a dog following me and it's a very scary dog. It's bitten me multiple times. Damn Yeah, 30 bucks for pushing the guy down the, the, the hill. <laughs> no, you're not. Oh gosh, you can't find that. They know where I am, but they can't find me. <laughs> There's four of them just standing there looking at me. Bam. 
We did it. That's an excellent, Jimmy. Mind if I can... Well done, Jimmy. You've completed all your assignments. If you'd like to come back to work on your skills, you're very welcome. Straight up. Awesome. You can kiss girls without having to give them a gift. Okay, let's test it out. It. Hey, girl. Yeah, guys, for right now, this will be the end of this episode here. Please leave a like down below if you enjoyed. Also, comment down below what you guys saw this video. Or what you guys think. Go share it with your friends, your grandma, over. Also, go follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Link should be down in the description down below. Also, go check me out on Discord. Link should also be down in the description down below. Also, go check me out on Twitch and TikTok. Link should also be down in the description down below. And subscribe to become a dude today. Remember, dudes, never get a salad in the bathroom. See ya!